as a six foot two man. Aeroplanes are fairly difficult to get into. All right, boys and girls, welcome back to. All right, boys and girls, welcome back to Ludix Aviation. Uh, today is a beautiful, clear day here in Orlando, which uh, is completely different from the other day when I came to try and do this exact same flight. Go back and watch that little video, a little video about uh, IFR ADM, I'll link it in the corner. But today I'm going up doing a little bit of IFR currency. I've not done any instrument approaches for a while. And those of you in IFR training should know, and then proceeding six months of the flight, six instrument approaches, uh, holding procedures, intersecting and tracking courses. That is the requirements. I need to meet those requirements again uh, by the end of this month. Time crunch. Today's plan, gonna go from here in Orlando to a, a local airport. It's an uncontrolled airport. There's a, an RNAV approach over there that I'm gonna go and do. Uh, and then I'm gonna swing it back around and do a, an ILS approach here into Orlando Executive. I'm gonna split the approaches up into separate videos. And there's also going to be a Patreon exclusive video. Ex Explaining more in detail uh, of my approach procedures and, and what I'm doing. So if you're interested in signing up to my Patreon and supporting the channel, you get exclusive content uh, at the Welcome to the Sky tier. There's other tiers as well. You can also get early access to videos and all that. Patreon.com forward slash Ludix Aviation. The link is in the description. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, young Bob is back! We're back! Oh, yet again. Safety pilot Bob coming in. Right seat Bob. Right seat Bob, that's what he's known as. So I think I graduated from young Bob to now <laughs> old Bob. Old Bob. <laughs> old, Bob. Old, old right seat Bob. I feel it. <laughs> After what? How long of instructing? Uh, hit two years in August. Two years in August. Uh, so I guess I'm what they call ex an experienced flight instructor. Or something very, now, very experienced. Considered. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not in your level of elite. No, 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 I mean, no, no. Not my level of punishment. Uh, I'll brief it in the sky. I might give you controls. Yeah, man. I can brief it. Yeah, uh, hell yeah. But I think we should do it in the sky. So that'll be good. Just uh, you know, anything. I, I might be a little bit rusty. One zero eight. So if you see anything, just speak up. You know okay. What I mean? Oh, Let me know. I will. For our <laughs> We're taxing too fast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just f***ing away. Flaps set. Uh, ah, let's, let's do a softie. Mixture rich, landing strobe lights coming on. Boom, boom, transponder, squawking altitude. Yes, we are. 1200, doors and windows closed. Ludix Aviation checklist complete. Get yours, ludixaviation.com. Best checklist that you'll ever use. Back me up, back me up. Yeah, best checklist ever. All my uh, students to use these checklists, and uh, your students should too. Ludixaviation.com. Yeah. Use code Young Bob for 50% off. That's not true. That's not uh, true. What an idiot! Let's go. Great tap. No, it's coming up. Oh, it feels weird. Left side. Oh yeah, I bet. I bet. This feels weird, and these controls feel really heavy. 40 knot cross check. B1. Rotate. Rotate. Buzz to rate. You're yep. up. Uh, oh. Whoa. <laughs> Let me just bring this back down into grinding back for a second, yeah? There we go, all right. That, that, was, the, that was the worst soft field takeoff you've ever seen in your life. What an idiot. We're flying, welcome to the skizzle. Welcome to the sky, my friend. Dude. Welcome to the sky. Yeah, not the best soft field example I've ever shown, which is weird, and to make it even weirder. This is sweet. It is. Thanks for taking me on this date, Lou. Yeah, no problem. I didn't, uh, I didn't know the plane had a I joystick. I don't... <laughs> <laughs> this is great banter. Come on. Like a drizzle. Like a drizzle. Like a drizzle. Boom, boom, boom. All right, let's talk about this then. I'm going to set up the approach, then I'm going to go up under the hood. All right, sweet. So let's go direct to Azubu right now. That's going to give you that heading. 283, please. We're doing the Anav GPS Bravo at Apoca. 334 is the approach course. It's all already sequenced in the... GPS, uh, runway landing, there's not applicable, touchdown zone elevation, not applicable, this is a circle only approach. Airport elevation, however, is 150. The Unicorn frequency, 123.05, let's throw that in on standby. Oops, well, that's not right, there we go, 123.05, boom, that's standby. Going to a Zubu, which is 2,000 feet, down to 1,700 at Tebow, 920 at 2.4, which is uh, from uh, runway 33, which is... F-15, F-15. Uh, circling minimum is 700, we need one mile visibility. We got plenty of visibility today, we're legal to shoot the approach. Miss approach is 2,000 straight ahead, direct to Mo uh, Modin and hold. That would be a parallel entry. Skyhawk 734, Mike Golf, maintain VFR outside the Bravo for exchange approval. Ginger approval, see you for Mike Golf. 
There's four nine one zero. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. uh, I know both were flying eye sunglasses. That's right. I just cleaned mine. I can actually see out of them now. Yes. Okay. Yeah. The best sunglasses for pilots. The clue is literally in the name. Flying eyes. Get ten percent off flying eyes by using my discount code Lude Dicks. The link to my flying eyes page is in the description. All right. Cool. We're switching around two two five. Climb. We're at two thousand feet. We're gonna hold that. We're gonna do all this. Uh, yeah, winds are, winds are, winds are winded, man. Winds are winded, bro. Winds are winded. Definitely, definitely felt the, uh, when I was flying over downtown there, it was like, right. All over the place. Yeah. All right, we're at 2,000. There's a Zubu, so technically now we can go down to, uh, 1,700. I like it. So that's what we're going to do. I know we didn't, we didn't, you know, I know we're practicing, but didn't really need to climb up. BFR, that was good. Did no, the whole thing. Yeah, do the whole thing. Uh, so we're going to 1700 at uh, Tebow. Uh, Popka traffic, Sky 734, Mike Golf. Seven and a half mile final on the RNAV uh, GPS Bravo into runway 33. The Popka. Okay, we're on the course. We are coming up to 1700. Don't go below it. We are two miles away from the fix. My pre landing checklist. Boom, boom, boom. This is the thing about uh, instrument stuff, division of attention. Sway. Crazy. Pull that out before landing approach briefing, seat belts, mixture, landing light, fuel selector, flaps, cab ready. So we're directly over top of the field. 555 five, Romeo, we're directly over top of the field. Alright, 1.4. Perfect. Perfect. Slide path is alive. As I'm just don't go below 1700. There you go. Slide path's alive. We're going to pull the car P on. We're going to start to slow it down in anticipation. Yeah, wind is definitely a big factor in. Definitely. Yeah, the plane looks like it's... And that's the thing, just like, for the people at home, just find something that works. Set something, see what it does. If it works, great. If not, change it again, just ever so slightly. Just like I'm having to change this altitude to maintain my actual minimum. What an idiot. There you go. Schmuck. Get back there, drop it. Give me 20 push ups. <laughs> yeah. No, you have choice. All right, we're 0.7 from Tebow. I'm going to hold off on the flaps for a, a little minute, although I will slow down. And then it's 9.20 from Tebow to 15, or F15, one of traffic, station here in Vivian, 7 miles. 1700. We're slowing it down. We're below the. That's giving me that. I'm going to go flaps 10. Below flap speed, 85, still on the course. Glide path's coming in. Oh yeah, looking good. We're looking good. We're looking good. And we are, oh my head in the, the buoy there at 17. Perfect. There uh, we go, 1700 down to 920 now. 920. Bring that power back. Want to maintain a round. Well, let's do round 80 knots, 75, 80. I'll, I'll, I'll take that on this, uh, on this windy day. We want to be 920 at yeah. F10, so let's do that. We're on the glide path, looking all right. Pre-landing right. checklist is all done, just some final checks. Good, good, good. Good. Two eight seven level Lima, left cross one, runway five, one eight. Okay. Bang. Glide path. It's squirrely. Yeah, it's squirrely. Airspeed is all over the place, man. Yeah, that's not even <laughs> you. <laughs> but your flying is so good, everyone yeah, will think it's a calm day. That's what, yeah, that, that, that's, uh, that's what I'm going for, man. That's right. what I'm going for. <laughs> Patronize me. Don't me. Terrific one zero twelve numbers way. Patronize. Thirteen hundred. We're going down to nine twenty for F ten, and then the the minimum is seven hundred. Circling minimum. Eleven hundred for nine twenty at F ten. Still on the still on course. Just ever so slightly below the glide path. We're at thousand. Once uh, ten twenty for nine twenty. Okay, so it's definitely one. Well, there we go. Yeah, that kind of works now, but still. Yeah, uh, one second. So we're past FT now. We can go down to 700. We're near the traffic to a four thousand. Right. Left crosswind five. Still on the path. Glide path's good. Oh, sorry, still on the course. Glide path's good. Go down to 700. Still at 80 knots. Looking good, or around there. And uh, say I'm going to hold it at 700 and then wait till the missed approach point. 700 feet, we're going to hold that. I'm going I'm to look up. Okay, let's pretend I don't have the runway in sight. However, hey, I'm happy with that. That's not too bad, huh? I will take that. Yeah. 
You could you could definitely land that. Up, yeah, I like that. Without a doubt. Click. So we are 1.2 from uh, the missed approach point. Right. This is where we're going to hold. Don't see it yet. Don't see it yet. Yeah, we don't have it in sight yet. At this point, if that was real, I'd already be at this point like, okay, I'm getting ready to go. Right, right. You know. Today, yeah. Even if you saw it now, what, the, what are you going to do? Drop 700 feet exactly, on top of yeah. the runway? There's nowhere. There's nowhere. Point 0.8, like definitely no. Like if I just look up, there's nowhere that you, you, you're doing that safely. No shot. No shot. Alright, arriving at the waypoint. Still there. And... We are... Going. Uh, Popka traffic, Sky X734, Mike Golf, Rob, the runway 1000 feet, uh, going missed off the RNAV GPS, Bravo. Swinging it around, doing one more. The Popka. Hi man, Yoga Jaws. Mike Trent, Yoga Jaws. Not too, not too upset with uh, how that went. I think I maintained the, the course well enough, the glide path, I was just slightly below it uh, at, at certain points, but got it back. Minimums wise, I maintain my minimums. 2000 at Azubu, 1700 at Tebow, 920 at F15, and then down to the 700 feet minimum. We didn't see the runway, we went missed. Uh, that was, uh, I like that, man. I'm not upset with that. No, I'm not upset. That was, that was clean. Yeah. yeah, especially all the all the altitudes and all the points. Yeah, yeah. that was, that was I'll pretty take it. I'll take it, I'll take it. And that'll do it for this video, but there's more to come with an ILS approach into Orlando Executive next time. Uh, uh, oh. no, not the, not the best. It was great. No, not I loved best. it, man. Make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss it and that you don't miss the rest of my content that I've got coming your way. A lot more instrument stuff, I can tell you that. You can join my Patreon if you'd like for exclusive videos and perks. And finally, if you're going to get yourself some flying eyes, use my discount code LUDICS. It's going to save you 10%. You won't regret it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.